Hi everyone, my name is Christy and welcome to day 404 of trying a new makeup product every day. Today I'm trying out such an iconic product. I'm trying out the MAC Ruby Woo Red Lipstick. It's their Retro Matte Lipstick and I have this. It's the MAC Shiny Pretty Things All Stars Kit. And I got this from Ulta and I realized it's on sale right now at Ulta for only $15. It comes with the In Extreme Dimension 3D Black Lash Mascara and the Prep and Prime Fix Plus Skin Refresher, which I already tried, so it's not in here right now. And the Ruby Woo Lipstick. And I am so excited to try this out. I've been really looking forward to it and it's been hard to resist just whipping it out of the box and trying it, but I wanted to wait and do it in a video. So this is a kind of a mini version, but if you wanted to just get the lipstick, the full size version retails for $18.50. So for $15, this set is such a great deal. And so let's see how this shade looks. So cute and mini. All right, I'm gonna swatch it. Oh my gosh, that pigment is so beautiful. And this is a blue red, so it is gorgeous. It's supposed to be flattering on almost anyone from what I've heard. So I hope it'll look good. Oh, I'm so excited. Also, this mini lipstick seems like it'll be really nice to apply, even more precise than a full-size big lipstick, and it has a pointy tip, which I'm interested to see if that really helps make application easier. Gosh, this does not glide on, so I feel like I kind of look ridiculous as I'm trying to apply it. Okay, so lipstick is applied and I am absolutely in love with this shade. The shade really lived up to my expectations, my hopes, and it really does look so beautiful. I feel like it's flattering and just makes me feel so powerful and cool in this perfect red lip shade. Like I can absolutely see this being a go-to, a standard red lip in my looks. And I can understand why so many people have this as their go-to red because it does just look so beautiful. But this was honestly one of the most difficult lipsticks to apply. And that's because it just is so hard to drag along the lips. It just gets stuck. It doesn't glide at all. So that makes it kind of hard to get a precise shape. But once it's all applied, it looks perfect. It's fully opaque. It's not clinging to the dry patches. But since it is so difficult to apply, I definitely would need to use a lip liner to make sure that I can really get precise edges. But the edges are not that bad. I would like for them to be a little bit more crisp, but they look fine. And then I did read that they recommend applying the Prep and Prime to your lips first. And I haven't tried that before, but now I really want to, to see if it does help the lipstick glide on better. If you've tried that, let me know in the comments down below your thoughts on the Prep and Prime and how it affects the lipstick. But I will say you don't need the Prep and Prime for this lipstick to look beautiful. And the matte finish looks so beautiful, but it's not a drying matte at all. It almost kind of looks just like a natural finish to the lips where they just look healthy. And I'm really curious how this transfer test will go. Wow, that is so minimal for a red lipstick and a lipstick that's out of a stick too, not just a liquid lipstick. Like that is really good. Yeah still fully intact on my lips. So I love this is actually going to be long lasting. Oh, this is definitely one of the most long lasting stick lipsticks I've ever tried. And I've tried a lot of them. 
So yay, all in all, I am so happy about this. And this just makes me want to wear red lip so much more often because of how confident it makes me feel. And I think that is the goal of a red lipstick. If you can throw this on and just feel confident to take on whatever you need to take on, that is the best thing. So I highly recommend this to give you that type of feeling and that feeling of power. And you know what? After this, I'm going to the grocery store and I'm going to wear my red lipstick to the grocery store because why not? <laughs> this makes me feel like red lips don't need to be for just a glamorous, special occasion. <laughs> and I just really feel like I'm living my best life when I'm wearing this, so that's amazing. And also, I have a giveaway that's still open until March 17th where I'm giving away a $20 Ulta gift card to celebrate my achievement of getting 2,000 subscribers. So it's a thank you to you for all of the amazing support that I've received so far. And I'll leave in the description box down below the instructions for the giveaway. It's very easy. And thank you so much for watching today. Be sure to like, comment, and subscribe to my channel so you can see the makeup that I try every day and I will see you tomorrow in my next video.